How unshackled are you today with these numbers after the spin-off? Good morning, Vaz. Good morning, Manus. Good morning, Danny. Great to, to see you both. You know, it's been a six-year journey to transform Novartis into a pure play innovative medicines company. We've done about $100 billion of transactions over this time. We created three global leading businesses, supported the creation of a consumer health business, the Alcon I device business, spun off Sandoz into a leading generics company. And now what I see everyone is seeing coming through in, in the third quarter is Novartis as a pure play innovative medicines, I think, powerhouse. And you see we were able to deliver double-digit sales growth, over 20% core, uh, core uh, profit growth, which really shows, I think, the business now really showing what it can deliver as a pure play innovative medicines company. What do you think, then, is the next challenge that you face on the horizon, given you've pivoted to this pure play model? What do you need to conquer next? You know, for us, it's going to be delivering in our four core therapeutic areas. A big mantra now inside the company is focus, focus, focus. And we need to keep delivering strong pipeline assets and launches in oncology, cardiovascular and renal diseases, immunology, and neuroscience. And when you look at the portfolio of medicines that we have, we think we have nine major medicines that have multi-billion dollar potential that can deliver that growth over the coming years. We've guided to 4% plus growth and 40% core operating income margins out into 2027. And when you look at the, the performance of some of those growth drivers, we're really excited about the performance of our breast cancer drug, Kiskali, our multiple sclerosis drug, Casimpta, the emerging uh, uh, performance of our Pluvicto uh, prostate cancer medicine, amongst others. So I think everything's headed in the right direction, but of course, we're going to have to consistently deliver on that pipeline and launches to be successful.